Okay, welcome back, YouTube. We're uh, in the middle of our stream here. Um, getting ready. Oh, it would probably help if I got the uh, bag up here. Got our uh, bonsai uh, bag five pulled here. We never built bag five back when we built this set originally. Um, it's been a uh, it's been lovingly displayed on my shelf ever since. But uh, getting into the tail end of spring here, I think it's time we get this frog army unleashed. So we're gonna we're gonna go for bag five here and get our springtime update. And then maybe this year will be when we remember. Oh, bag six. Is there another bag of this? Oh no, bag six is the this thing. Okay, so yeah, we skipped over bag five. Alright. So these are just alternate branches that you can build that you can swap out, and of course they come with the fabled pink frog army. And an incredible amount of pink frogs on display. doing the cherry blossoms here. So let's see here. We've got a couple different handlebar lengths here. That's how we're going to get this puppy started. says uh, these branch connectors were originally used as mini doll bicycle handlebars. So those are going to be the mini dolls from the uh, Lego Friends line. The uh, mini dolls are a little different from mini figures, so we actually have the mini doll and... Well, I swear I saw one. Oh, maybe I was just looking at it at a different angle. Well, there's handlebars that are different for the minifigures, too. Let's see here. Okay. Get, some, get some froggies going here. The colorful blossoms on this tree are actually frog elements from earlier Lego sets. Yes, that is pretty plain to see. Okay, oh, let's see here. We gotta disconnect these guys up here. All right, so let's see, we can just move this stand out of the way. And 
these just slide right off. Yes, they do. Groovy. And then this guy as well. Okay. Hidden frog under here, too. So let's see here. Orient this properly. I need to dust this set. It's hard to dust it because the canned air just obliterates all of these little pebbles. I need to pour them out and then Okay. So that goes right there in the middle. Taking the place of the previous one. It's the first time these frogs have been seen in this light purple color. That's, that's pink. This color is pink. So, now, I'm going to build these assemblies that are going to keep these things, uh, attach these things to the branches here. So, let's see here. We're going to need three of these. So, probably build these concurrently then, get to the end of the page, and then build the next iterations. Okay. Right. Part number So nine of this assembly. With 101 frogs available, this is the greatest number of frogs used in any single Lego set. Well, that that makes sense. That does not that's not too surprising. Go 
one frog, two frog, three frog, four frog. Come on, buddy. Hop on there for me. it up here. are mirrored so even if I lose track of which direction the handlebars are facing it shouldn't really matter here. Should be able to just knock them all out and then get them oriented uh, in the next step. were the same way where it was like <laughs> they all face the same way and then it's just the angle at which you put them onto the tree adds the variety in the look I remember being uh, remember being fairly impressed by that given the the way the build went it ends up looking really nice had a thought to myself, 108 frogs, I must be missing frogs, and sure enough, missing frogs I was, they go on the top of these branch clusters as well. Let's 
so. Okay. So there's three, so now we can assemble one of these guys here. clips on like this kind of hard to see how is this supposed to attach it doesn't really look like there's room for it there unless I spread them out yeah well maybe they're supposed to be spread out This can rotate, okay. Spend some gravel here too. Alright, there we go. Alright. Let's build some more branches here. on this branch. It will be it does really accelerate once you memorize your frog placement. Oops. He said making a frog mistake. frogs. Okay. That's four out of the nine branches down. Let's keep on trucking here. frogs we're gonna have here Alright, 
That's five, so more than halfway through our frog placement now. Everywhere. Frogs, 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 frogs. Leap into the air. I'm singing a frog song. I'm making it up as I go. I'm singing a frog song to celebrate these pink frogs on branches white as snow. That's my frog song. Another set done. We can get these going here. Kachook. Like having the ones on top kind of tight. And these ones. Okay. on here honestly without mooshing up all the frogs into each other there we go that's not a lot of clearance okay there we go Maybe. you gotta arrange your branches just so tight tight cluster Ugh. all right one great big stretch and we're back to frog town here there's a tremendously funny terrible action movie uh, from the 90s? Late 80s, maybe? Called uh, Hill Comes to Frogtown, starring the wrestler uh, Rowdy Roddy Piper. Um, it is truly a buck wild uh, viewing experience. If, you, if you're if you into bad movies and you've never watched uh Hell comes to Frogtown. I I highly recommend that one. It is very ridiculous. Highly, highly ridiculous. through these frogs here. I guess 10 on every branch they end up going somewhat quickly. 
It was just such a big pile of them in the beginning, I thought, there's no way. But here we are. Ultimate frog placement. Oh, zero extra frogs. All frogs utilized? I thought for sure these frogs would count as a as a one by one or smaller. Like we get an extra flower blossom here, but here we go. Penultimate frog. Final frog. Ribbit. Alright. Now we just gotta arrange up our final branch here, and we'll be we all set. Seasonal bonsai flowering arrangement applied. This one's a little further out from the tree, so this one should be a little more painless to get on there. Go, okay. Yeah, that looks really sweet. All right. So there we go, the spring update on our bonsai tree. And, uh, yeah, that puts us up right about an hour and a half into the stream, so I think we're going to go ahead and wrap it up here. I don't think that's enough time to really get started on anything else. So we're going to call it here, but we should be back next week at our usual time where we'll uh, do something, probably something Star Wars-y. I've got a couple Star Wars sets to start, so I think that's uh, likely where I'll go. But to anyone watching on YouTube, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you guys for stopping by the stream. Uh, appreciate your time. And uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed our, our frog uh, uh, paradise here. Looks really cool. It's a really, uh, it's a really ingenuitive way of uh, making the cherry blossoms uh, pop. So yeah, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next week. Bye!